just did my DNA. Hello chums, my name's Christopher Columbus, I did discover America, rumours are true. That's my brother Matt. How's it going, Jones? And welcome to this very, very special video. This video is more special than any video I've released in my YouTube career. It's a it very really special, special video one. today, very I'm special I'm going to cut to the chase, mate. Can well, I cut to the chase? Go for it. Thanks, mate. A few weeks ago, we played FIFA 14. I know, it's exciting. It we is, played FIFA 14, chaps. We were invited to EA Guildford. Um, fantastic day. Not only did we play the game, we got to meet a lot of great people, yeah. which included a lot yeah. of YouTubers. Yes. Uh, we met Cal Freezy, Matt HD, Rossi HD, FIFA Rally, who flew from Denmark yes. just, just, yeah. for the day. just for the day. What yeah. a legend. Yeah. Um, KSI, who arrived at 5 o'clock. A little bit it late, was wasn't he? a little bit late. He was, mate. Yeah. Yeah. A little bit late. And ne also, Nepo was ne meant to turn up, but he wasn't there. But unfortunately, yeah. couldn't make it. But yeah. there we go, mate. Yeah. Top lads. I'm proud to be part of this community to be yeah, honest you know? yeah and we're going to give you some information today about yeah so game. basically in this video we are going to be talking about the new features that we got to play yeah now it was a very early kind of you know build of the game so we got to take that into consideration but nevertheless we will be talking about those new features yes. that will be in the game but from what we played it was bloody fantastic yes looking Amazing. looking very excited are you excited for fifa 14 yeah, now hit that like button yeah. right now let's get a thousand likes yes. on this video yeah, let's it's, do it. it's important we nail the likes on this yes, one because I want this video to spread so all the FIFA uh, do you, mate? all the FIFA uh, players can see this information about FIFA yeah. 14. Also, so. we got a killer question for you guys. What FIFA had the best soundtrack? Good, Leave a comment. Good question. For me, it would be FIFA 2005. Yeah, I'd probably agree with you there, mate. Now, shall we get on with this and get on to the first point of FIFA 14? Let's get on with Let's it. Let's go. Okay, so the first point we're going to touch on here is the build-up play. Now, EA really want to push that reward system of really building up play throughout a game. Instead of just bombing that through ball right, you know, straight through the middle to, I don't know, Kone or Bent, something like or that. Or Murta Sakura or Carragher. Maybe not Murta Sakura or Carragher, but basically... You know, the, the build-up play. So this will basically mean that each player on the pitch will have a behaviour yeah. to really sort of use their intelligence to, you know, see someone running and they will run with that person and mark up tight. Yeah. And also people will be coming for the ball, you know, really sort of helping the team out when, you, when you're on the ball kind of thing. Yeah, and I, and I can tell you, chaps, from my experience playing the game when I beat him 3-0, yeah. um, it was certainly very difficult in the sense that yeah. with FIFA 13, I'm used to being one of these yeah, players yeah, who yeah, does yeah. utilise over-the-top through balls, yeah. um, running down wings yeah there was none of that honestly yeah. i was struggling you know it was um, a lot more build-up style yes it was you definitely saw that you could really notice yeah. it in yeah. the game a lot yeah. of build-up football yeah. which is fantastic to see yeah it is I, a, it's a great you know i think throughout the years they're really pushing this yes. one bit by bit yeah and, you know but this year is better. better than yeah, ever in that sense better, for yeah. the build-up play yeah yeah so then, chaps, what I want to talk about now is teammate intelligence. Now, when I beat Matthew Columbus 3-0, I basically did notice that... You didn't have to bring that up. I did, mate. It's very important. People know I rogered you. It's really important <laughs> for the video. Oh, come on, mate. You're embarrassing me. Basically, players now make more intelligent runs. And what do I mean by this? Yeah. Basically, in FIFA 13, I often find um, you'll make a killer ball, the yeah. player will be offside, and you'll sort Very of, frustrating. And you'll say to yourself, oh, you know, you could have stayed onside mm -hmm. there. Well, in FIFA 14... Players make more intelligent runs. They yes. will stay on side. Yes. They will drop off mm -hmm. to stay on side. Yeah. And it's generally more intelligent AI. Okay, so the next feature in FIFA 14 to talk about is the protect the ball feature. And this feature was something I was really looking forward to because in previous FIFAs, you were only able to protect the ball while moving really slowly. Now, in FIFA 14, you can now actually protect the ball while running. So yeah. if you are running down the wing or running anywhere, basically you see a defender, you know, catching you up, you yeah. can then start to protect the ball while you're running. So that's pretty beast. It gives you more time on the yeah. ball. It gives you more time, those few extra seconds to pick out those killer passes to make a few turns etc etc so it all adds up to the build-up play of the game like we were talking about before yeah and of course it's just a fantastic you know viable option now to stay in possession of the ball yeah so then, chaps, what I want to talk about now is dribbling. Now, basically, in FIFA 13, when you dribble with the ball, although, let's face it, I'm not much of a skiller. I'm always crossing it, aren't I, mate? Yeah, mate, you yeah, are, yeah. I've got a bit of a reputation yeah. for that. Um, However, but, you might be more of a skiller in FIFA 14. Yes, maybe I will do more skills in FIFA 14. Basically, now, in FIFA 13, you've got hold LT and flick the right analog stick. Now, yeah. in FIFA 14, there's no LT, so it's literally a case of flicking the right analog yeah. stick. Yeah. That is it. That is how yeah. you do skills. No and, LT. And I don't know about so, you, but when we were playing the 
game, I found myself using the skills a yeah. lot more. So I think we will be seeing perhaps some yeah, more, skills more skills and more variety in football exactly, with FIFA 14. Yes, yes. And also another point with this sort of dribbling section, while you are sprinting with the ball, usually there was only a 22 and a half degrees curve that you could, you know, turn while running with the ball. However, now you can turn at any direction while sprinting yeah. with the ball. It will shift weight of the, the player and it will basically move momentum and, you know, it will generally... I mean, there's a load of mechanics in it that I'm not going to go into, but basically you can now move a lot more freely while sprinting with the yeah, ball. Yeah, a lot more freedom yeah, in your yeah, football on this yeah, one. Yeah. So then, chaps, what I want to discuss now is shooting. Now, with the shooting on FIFA 14, um, from my experience of playing the game, mm -hmm. the ball was more sort of variable in the air. So, yeah. for example, you would have shots. Now, I scored a really nice goal with Stuart Downing when I beat him 3 He scored a bit of a scream in there. Yeah, when, yeah. I, when I beat um, yeah. you 3-0. Basically, I had a shot with Downing and the ball dipped and it was really, really realistic. The yeah. ball physics yeah. were fantastic. Yeah. So shooting this year is not going to be repetitive. I think that actually was the main thing that I noticed about playing FIFA 14 was the shooting was a lot more authentic. Yeah. You know, the shots weren't all the same at all. In previous FIFAs, you found them very linear almost. Yeah. But these are very sort of free-flowing. Yeah. And a lot also knuckle shots are in the game. So, you know, the ball's moving yeah. around in the air like that. And um, yeah, and you've got the dipping shot you've got rising shots and yeah the shooting is is just generally a lot more authentic and it yeah. is a lot more better to what so then chaps to summarize things what did i take away from this experience from playing fifa 14 for me i'm really really impressed and pleased to see the build-up football yes. that is what i took yeah, away yeah. Uh, from the event yeah. We've got so many good features, but for me, that was at the top. Yeah, definitely that build-up play and, and the, the gameplay and, and, and the intelligence of marking. Go on. Yeah, but the, the general gameplay is a lot slower. Yeah, it was a lot slower. Build-up play was a lot more rewarding. Yeah, um, but I really like the shooting as well. Like we said, yeah. the shooting is you know it's really authentic. Much, much better. Great to see some yeah. cracking goals. We're going to see more shots, some swerving shots. Fantastic. And it'll be great for montages. Great. You know, for we're going to see goals. more variety yeah, 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 in goals. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. with the skills being yeah. more accessible. If great. Skills being more accessible. Yes. Yeah. Of course, yeah. I mean, I found myself doing a lot more skills than I... I mean, I don't do skills at all, but I don't know. Something about not pressing LT yeah. really made me want to do skills more. I don't know, Just it's weird. Because you're, you're rubbish at skills. Uh, yeah, so. so basically, let's get this to a thousand likes. We will upload a pack opening later on today. Yeah, let's come on, nail that thousand likes. A thousand and likes, you're going to get another video today. Yeah. And also, what FIFA, or which FIFA, had the best soundtrack? In the comments. For me, FIFA 05. FIFA 05, that, we said that, mate, yeah. Other than that, yeah, come on, sure man. Get on with it. Enough room. We'll see you tomorrow, chaps. Yeah. Actually, later. God. Yeah, I always do that. Yeah, go on. See you later. See you later, chums. No matter how much it winds me up, I just can't pull myself away. No matter how much it makes me rage, FIFA's just in my DNA. No matter how.